Okay, there. Okay. Alright. New drama, new drama. What is this, dude? Midori, what is this? What? I don't understand. What's the problem? Why can't I do this on stream? I don't understand. <laughs> Someone please tell me. <laughs> Yo, so wait a minute. So it's okay to stream the simulator, but not this. <laughs> Y'all gonna retweet this, brother? <laughs> Hell yeah. Y'all, as a housing main. <laughs> <laughs> As a housing main. <laughs> oh my God. Dude, people really do find anything. Wait, so, okay, okay, wait a minute here. I'm confused. Why as a housing main, do you feel that it's embarrassing to do this? Wouldn't as a housing main, you would want to do this? They don't want to get exposed. But this isn't third party, right? This doesn't interact with the game, remember? Because some people seem to think that the only thing that's third party is interact with the game. Someone seriously explain it to me. As a housing main, why is this bad? These motherfuckers act like I'm streaming the fucking Zoom hack. What? They got exposed and they're angry? Oh, they're jealous. What? People want you to suffer in game. I don't understand. Okay, here we go. Most disappointing moment of my day was opening Twitch to this. Damn, you must have had a pretty good fucking day then. Maybe I jinxed myself. I was looking last night for a housing stream to mindless watch. Honestly, don't care if they use it, but geez, doing it so openly with a huge platform following and tagging the official game while you openly break the TOS. Wait, how is this breaking TOS? How? Okay, wait, what is wrong with this? They're utilizing a third-party program for housing, which also officially streaming under... No, 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 no. Remember? Okay, if this is a third-party program, then Discord is a third-party program. This isn't interacting with the game. This is where it gets confusing. Does a third-party program have to interact with the game or does it not? Because this isn't interacting with the game. I can close the game and still do this. It's because of offenders like this that Howsinger is thought to be a tool maker. Who the fuck is Howsinger? I don't know who that is. It's TOS because... Yeah, I can't believe he's streaming 14 housing with that shiny... They're going to make Father P disappointed at us again. Wait a minute. Is that a TPP they're using on stream to decorate? What the fuck is a TPP? Yeah, it is pretty cringe. For real, yikes, bro. Oh, third party program. Okay, how come this is a third party program, but Discord isn't? It ain't even in game, Lamau. What's the issue? It's a sim and those don't break TOS. XFFing. Oh no. Uh, that's bait. Bro, don't do this on stream. What the fuck? Bruh, you are using the same shit. Stop complaining. XFFing. Your viewer count shot up 500 since I saw this? Yeah, because it's drama. Because you're thirsty motherfuckers. Okay, so I have a question. How is streaming this any different than a raid simulator? You can use a plugin to load all this into their house, so they're afraid their tool will be taken away. Ooh. Ooh. Well, see, that's where you fucked up. See, me, I don't use tools in the game, okay? That's your mistake, okay? If you don't want to cheat, then don't use the tools. See, I'm not using the tools, okay? I'm not loading in shit. Expose them. Expose them. It's not, but people want to have a reason to be mad because they can't get a house, all right? Because they make money using this and then charge people in-game to make their houses. Wait, this costs money to use? I didn't pay anything to use this. Yeah, it's free. Oh, they charge Gil in-game? Oh, house designers and shambles oh how does that even make sense how does me streaming this have anything to do have any impact whatsoever on someone designing a house no the designers use it and then charge people that don't know about it oh well guess what <laughs> go to that site brother and uh <laughs> you can just fuck around in there for as long as you want <laughs> I don't understand how this would fuck over designers because designers are like, you know, super creative and shit, right? That's so weird. If you know what the program is capable of, I'm not going to explain why it does break TOS. Well, if you use the in-game third-party program, that's your fault. Exactly. 
Dude, imagine this. Most disappointing moment of my day was opening Twitch to this. Holy shit, dude. You must have been at a spa getting your feet rubbed and your dick sucked and you had a limo take you there. You had a limo ride home and then you had someone turn on the Twitch for you and someone carried you into your house while you were asleep and this is what you saw. Holy fuck. I ruined this guy's day. Jesus Christ. Honestly, don't care if they use it. Well, yeah, no shit because you fucking use it. It's a standalone program. Yeah, what the fuck? What is wrong with this guy? How come every day somebody tries to fuck with me, man? What's crazy? This man could literally hire a decorator. It's a website. He's not in the game. <laughs> That's crazy, dude. Dude, yo. Dude, I'm I am so jealous of this guy's life. Can you imagine being this upset about nothing? Dude, how come that every time somebody fucks with me, it's like they're getting mad about nothing? They're literally getting mad about nothing. They're just making shit up. This is insane to me. Is this one of those guys that tweets all this third party shit like all the time? Yo, I bet they used all this third party and shit to make this, man. Oh, this is sick. This is sick, bro. That's sick. So this person's mad because I'm streaming this. I would feel like as a housing main, this would make you happy because then that means like more people are getting into housing. I feel like that this person is like deeply, deeply invested into housing and they feel like that housing is like, is like theirs, right? You know, like it's theirs, it's their content. It's why they play the game. And if they deem anyone not worthy of their content, you know, it's wrong. This is so stupid. This would be like if I saw someone streaming the simulator and I retweeted their stream and I was like, as a raider main, y'all make me sad. <laughs> <laughs> the next time I see somebody streaming with a simulator, dude, I'm going to retweet. I'm going to say that. I'm going to retweet their stream and I'm going to say, as a Raider main, this makes me fucking happy. I'm so happy that more people are using the simulator. More people are getting into raiding. You know, more people are making the best use of their fucking time. Oh, they want to feel unique at something. Oh, well, tough shit, guys, because, uh, well, let me let me show you a really awesome tool. It's that right there, man. It's really fucking awesome, man. It lets you do all this cool shit, you know? Unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to finish this because drama, but it's called the Make Place. It doesn't interact with the game, so it's not third party. People don't use third party program under the official game tag and so openly. I don't care if I get made fun of, but this isn't third party. This person's literally just mad to get mad. It's only three guys caring why I care so much. It, like, why do, why do people say that? If it's not a problem, why do you care so much? Bro, I shot up 600 fucking viewers. Is, is this really such a hard concept for you motherfuckers to understand? I don't care. I really don't. But if it's going to get me fucking viewers, then I'm going to talk about it. Like how hard, like as a content creator, how hard is that to understand? Like maybe for you, oh, I don't have to care about it. Dude, I eat that shit up, man. Whenever people start drama with me, I just get stronger and stronger. Dude, it's like I'm a con content vampire and all these people are they have all this content and i'm just you know and i just absorb their drama and i just grow stronger and stronger and then the viewer count just goes higher and higher why the fuck would i not talk about it <laughs> is it really that hard of a concept to understand it's free content in a dead game i've never heard someone refer to themselves as a housing main as an erp main this is cringe can you be an rp main an erp main as a wankage main i can attest you're a cringe main zeems yo for those of you here for the housing drama here's my house that i did myself here's my house the womb of entropy welcome peasants i hope you enjoy your stay for you will not be allowed to leave. <laughs> yeah, see, this is cool, man. Kind of like Dark Souls s kind of stuff, you know, with like the broken, like like the broken tower, like the destroyed towers, you know, the trees. You got the fire, so it's kind of like that. And then on the inside, and I did all this too. And no, I didn't use third party. No, unlike some of you fuckers, I don't cheat. Okay, dude, I am a housing amateur, okay? I'm not even like intermediate. But anyway, so yeah, so like, you know, you have the stone walls here, you know, the candles, it's very, very low lit, you know? You got like the wine over here, the potions, the concoctions, you know, you got the nice fireplace. You got the Yamato right here. And there's some more wine and stuff, you know, some wood for the fire. Like the theme of this is supposed to be like vampire castle. And then like down here, 
it turns into like more evil shit, you know, like Silent Hill, like, you know, a cultist like refuge, you know, a summoning thing here, you know, and then a coffin, you know, with some gargoyles. So you have the grates and the pipes. You know, and then you got this cage, the cage with the blood. You got the book. You know, it's ironic because I can't even read this fucking thing, man. Housing designer myself. It has always been an iffy topic regarding third party program and housing community as it's not a respected as using tools for G posing. Why isn't it as respected? It's stupid practice to use the official hashtag, the official 14 and modded screenshots. So I assume the same sentiment is shared here. Would you agree or not agree that the make place is third party by itself? It's not third party. It doesn't interact with the game, correct? It doesn't matter what you can do with it, right? Because by going by that logic, then that means that Discord is third party because Discord can interact with the game. I think what it is, is that the, because the housing community and the RP community, they're more secretive than like, I guess the rating community for some fucking reason. And I think all you pussies and idiots just think the same fucking thing. You just have to realize that it's all fucking third party. Like the Sims and shit, they're not because they don't interact with the game, but it's stupid because they help you more than some third party. Basically Square Enix has turned you into a sheep, right? It's turned a bunch of people that play this game into sheep, into thinking that something's third party when it's not third party and something that probably should be considered third party isn't third party. Does that make sense? I think that a majority of people that play this game, they listen to Square Enix without questioning whatsoever. I think that they should use their brains more. That's what I think. They're just mad they spent 20 hours glitching one piece of furniture and you can just tap the whole house with a plug on. Yeah, so it's standalone, right? If you're using the application, it only becomes third party when the plugin is used in game personally. Personally, I don't care just to focus on. Yeah, okay, so here's the thing, right? Like I'm not using that to load into the game, right? So I don't see why people are getting all fucking shitty and stuff. As people who work in software industry, people have no clue how software works. Yeah, I agree with that. I don't have any idea. Dude. <laughs> I just think it's really weird, right? I think it's a double standard, right? I think it literally makes no sense. Like if someone is going to stream the make place, that is different than if they stream them using third party because make place by itself is not third party. It's completely separate from the game. It has no connection to the game. Someone getting mad about that. They're literally just stupid. What the fuck? Zeme's prisoner. Oh my God. Save him. How'd you get in there? I don't even know how to get in there. How'd you get in there? Save him! What? Is that Lollafell specific? Oh my god! <laughs> how do I get out? Get me out of here. What I just did is more third party than what I was streaming earlier. Yeah, I feel like some people treat this game like it's literally made for them and that they have any say so in like how, how things work and you, you know, that type of shit. You know what I mean? It's just a really weird mentality. This person made a good point. I don't understand why anyone yeah. gives a shit when only like 3% of the player base has access to housing and it affects literally oh. nobody. People in this game need real fucking issues. Holy shit, you know what? That's a good point. I feel like more people <laughs> raid than do housing. I feel like there are more raiders than there are people with housing. I feel like the people with housing is like some of the smallest percentage of players. Modem, VIPM, gift them a sub. All right, I'm going to stream this, man. I can't wait for a fucking raider main to call me out on this shit. Raider main here. And you... You streaming this is absolutely ridiculous. Like, it's fucking cringe, bro. Yikes. It's cringe. Yikes. I can't believe he's in the 14 directory streaming a sim. That's so cringe. Yikes. As a as a Raider main, I feel like that this is the most cringe thing you can do. Super yikes, bro. Yeah, they just said, please don't use third-party programs under the official game tag so openly. I don't care if I get made fun of. That's literally all he said. I heard his feelings. I mean, good. He deserved to have his feelings, sir, for saying something fucking ridiculous. If I said something stupid, I would hope my feelings would be hurt so I could learn from it. <laughs> I am not under the belief that you should not have your feelings hurt. If you do something wrong or say something stupid, you absolutely should have your feelings hurt. You should feel bad. You should feel stupid. Hopefully you will learn from the experience. Feeling bad about something means that you are going to learn from the experience. I mean, how else are you supposed to learn? There comes a point in time where like, you know, obviously, you know, you don't want a person's feelings to be hurt too bad. You know, it comes to a certain point, but no, like, you know, if you say something stupid and you're embarrassed about it or someone calls you an 
idiot and you are an idiot for that particular moment, yeah, you deserve to feel like an idiot. I don't see how this is hard to comprehend, man. Well, what kills me, man, is like people don't think about what they type, man. People don't think about it. Like this person here that like tried to, I guess, call me out, which I don't know why, dude. I don't know why. People have been trying to call me out in Final Fantasy like a shit ton over the past like couple months, man. It's been insane. This is what this guy said. As a housing main, y'all make me sad. And then he linked my stream like I was doing something I wasn't supposed to be doing. They are utilizing third-party program for housing, which also officially streaming. So like, this is how stupid this person is. This person isn't upset that I'm using this program. This person is upset that I'm using the program and I'm under the Final Fantasy 14 tag. So if I was like not under this tag, this, pr this person probably wouldn't give a shit. So like, that is how fucking dumb this person is. At first, I thought it was a joke. You know what I mean? But then like, holy shit, this is ridiculous. <laughs> As a housing main... Oh my God, dude. It's like this person is so insecure and they're like holding on to their housing, I guess like their housing tools. And cause obviously this person uses third party, right? Like obviously. So this person is just shitty because you know, their SIM and their third party is being exposed, you know? So they're being exposed of being like, you know, fucking cheaters and shit. Have I read the person's full response? No, I haven't. Did they fully respond? I feel like I need to clarify what my last tweet meant because people are taking it out of context. What? As a housing main, y'all make me sad. Okay, so this is the apology. Uh, and I'm getting not so nice things in my direct messages. It's super hostile. Look, man, I can't control what other people do. Obviously, I'm going to tell you to not message this guy. If you want to tweet on this, that is up to you. See, here's the thing I don't get. This fucking idiot posted this shit on Twitter. So all of this is public. And they said something really stupid. So then they're like, I simply posted this because it legitimately made me sad. Well, it obviously made you dumb. You obviously didn't think about it either. I asked them to not show up publicly because it's a risk to stream that while you're Twitch... Wait, dude... You don't give a flying fuck about my stream. Shut the fuck up. You do not give a fuck, okay? So don't even try to take that moral high ground. You don't want me to stream it because you don't want people to know about it because of you, because of selfish reasons. That's why. At least own up to your own stupidity. Like, don't bitch out. Don't be a fucking pussy now. You know, like, dude, if you're going to call me out and shit, I'm going to respond accordingly. And apparently people share my mentality. You're a fucking idiot. But again, let's see. It's risky to stream that while your Twitch says you're playing 14. Why, why would it be risky to stream while I'm playing 14? I literally am playing the game and I'm using a housing simulator of said game. Why the fuck wouldn't I stream in the 14 category, you idiot? It was simply stating that I felt sad about seeing that. Okay, I'm sorry if your streamer felt like I was attacking them. I don't think you're attacking me. I think that you got ass hurt for a dumb reason and you said some dumb shit. I don't know who the fuck you are, man. This is the first time I've ever even heard of a housing main. Sorry it took so long to write something out. I was taking care of my kid and so I didn't get the chance to comment and interact with everyone who left a comment and quote retweeted me. I'm going to lock this for my mental health. So I apologize if you wish to say something more. Like I have no sympathy for this person. I'm going to lock this for my mental health. Maybe you should have done step one and not tweet something fucking uh, stupid. Ah, uh, shit. Yeah, sorry. Maybe I shouldn't tweet something fucking stupid and then get upset when people call me out on my fucking bullshit. You know what I mean? Like, it's not that hard, man. Like, just think about the tweet. Just think about what you say. That's the problem. People don't think about what they say. Like, holy fuck, man. Oh, God, my mental health on Twitter. Oh, God, I can't. I just can't take people proving me wrong on Twitter. Like, dude, just prevent it by not being an idiot to begin with. <laughs> like, you deserve to be called an idiot. You said something stupid. How is this hard to comprehend, man? If I say or do something stupid, okay, so like, let's say I die on this poll because of Mitt or because of something. I deserve to be called stupid. Hey, why are you dumb? Why'd you die? Because I'm an idiot. Because I fucked up. Okay, moving on. You just accept it. Holy shit, man. Because of my mental health? Get the fuck out of here with that. Jesus Christ. If your mental health is in question because of a tweet, you need to get the fuck off of the internet, man. God damn. I don't know why, but over the past like couple months, people keep trying to fuck with me. Bro, I'm just trying to play the game i'm just trying to clear this fucking fight so i can react that's like ridiculous though man like dude that just makes that just makes me have even less respect for that person because of my mental health i'm gonna lock this your mental health is so fragile that it can't even handle you making a mistake and being called out on it what the fuck that's just fucking insane to me i don't know man i just dude i just don't fucking get it man like i mean what the fuck did you think was gonna happen 
when you said when you said something stupid. I, I just I don't understand. I just don't get it. Like you say something, it's like that. It's like that fucking surprise Pikachu face. Says something stupid, gets called out for it. Surprise Pikachu. Okay, here's the thing. I feel like if people are DMing that person, I think that's a step too far. There's no need to do that, right? There's no fucking need to DM them. You can post on the tweet and that's enough. You know, like you could post your opinion on the tweet. You know, so it's not like I'm an entirely insensitive prick. I do think that if that person is getting DM'd, you know, about, you know, with some nasty shit, then obviously that's too far, you know? Like it, there's, there's, there's no need for that. If you want to have an opinion on the matter, then just post it, you know, publicly, you know? But like, dude, you can't, like, I don't feel sorry for them. I don't feel sorry for them if they're getting blasted in their fucking replies. Talkwise? I just don't because they don't deserve any. They did Kill this to themselves. C and you know? Three. They did this to themselves, man. Between C and 3. Like holy shit, I'll grab 3. Oh, All the tweets said that wrong. they're sad. I don't know what the problem is. Are well, like, like the problem is is like the stupidity of it. I'm like they got sad by something that they didn't even need to be sad about, man. Like oh, no, like no, if you get sad by cool seeing though. something like that, then you need to reevaluate yeah, like, what makes you sad. Nah. You know, like, because if that is going to make you sad, then I feel like that you're either not right in the head or you don't know what actual sadness is. That's what I feel. And two, it's the stupidity of it. It's like, you know, the oven is hot, but you still touch it. And then you cry and complain that you burned your hand. I'm not going to feel sorry for you. Like, are you kidding me? Like, what the fuck? I don't understand. Like, if you feel sad and you need to express yourself, like Twitter is probably not the best place to fucking do that, man. If you have like a personal Twitter, right? Like if you don't have like a lot of followers or you're Twitter is more for like close friends. Why in the fuck would you literally tweet at a streamer with like 2k plus viewers at the time? Like, do you guys not understand how fucking stupid this person is? It was like every single decision they made, the next one doubled in stupidity. All these fuckers are about to harass that idiot. I mean, look, man, I can tell I you not to, but here's the thing. They posted it on a public forum, right? I don't feel sorry for him. I'm going to tell you guys not to do it. If you want to go and like state your opinion, that's on you. Obviously. Obviously, don't go and attack this person. You know, that's 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 not right. Like, I'm not upset at this person. I have no idea who this person is, you know, but it's just this person is going to act like an idiot towards me. So I'm just going to, you know, I'm going to respond accordingly. You know what I'm saying? Well, you think his motive was to get you banned, but backfired? I have no idea. They kept comparing the simulator to third party, which is wrong because the simulator is not third party. According to Square Enix, the definition of third party is things that interact with the game. Although I disagree with that definition, I think the simulators are actually more powerful than third party. Like the rating simulator is more powerful than any trigger that you can possibly have, in my opinion. But that's not how Square Enix sees it. Yeah, that's what I mean. Like this person is just trying to play the victim now. Oh, I'm getting harassed. Oh, my mental health, all this shit, man. Like, dude, you did this to yourself, man. I just have no sympathy. The people that do something stupid Once. and then they try to play that shit, man. Yeah. I just, I, I, dude, I don't care, man. Like, good. If you do something stupid, you deserve to feel stupid. I mean, I know that's sounds cold man i just cannot fathom doing something it's dumb and then not you know, feeling bad about it man that's just not how that's just not who i am as a person like if i make a mistake i want to know about the mistake i think it's just like today's society man how everybody's a winner but i'm old as fuck man you know i'm a dinosaur so it was just a different time man it was just a different time back in the day everybody wasn't a winner i don't know what that person was trying to accomplish i don't know maybe they were trying to get me banned i have no fucking idea man or maybe they were telling the truth maybe they were just were legitimately sad <laughs> I hope that they were trying to get me banned and not legitimately sad because holy fuck, that is like the dumbest thing you could get sad about, man. Holy fuck. If that's going to make you sad, then you don't actually know what, what sadness is. You don't know the meaning of that word. Like while both options are kind of cringe, at least one of the options is like, I don't know.